good afternoon uh, i am today i am going to give a micro lesson plan for the skill of stimulus variation so this is my chalkboard entry um, where i have given my roll number the class i am going to teach my subject and topic date period duration is 5 minute and cycle is teach so i'll go in the class and i'll uh, greet my students and uh, I'll ask them why from last year we all are confined to our home. We have to wear masks and maintain social distancing and hand hygiene. And I'll show them the chart and then I'll pause for three seconds. So definitely they will tell me it is because of COVID-19 or coronavirus pandemic. So they say, uh, then I'll say, see, we cannot see coronavirus with unaided eyes. Coronavirus, other viruses, and many other organisms are so small in size that they are not visible without microscope. Then using my hand gesture, the teacher will tell that in one pinch, there are thousands and thousands of them present. And because they are not visible and they are very small, that is why they are called microbes or microorganisms. So I'll use gesture and change in speech pattern. Then I'll tell them that virus are one kind of microbes. Some other microorganisms and microbes are fun fungi, bacteria, protozoa, and some kind of algae. Then I'll teacher will draw the picture of bread mold, spirogera, and they'll ask one student to come and draw a picture of amoeba on the blackboard. So one type child will draw it on the board and others will copy them in their notebook. So that will include movement of the teacher and student, then audio-visual switching, and physical involvement of the student. And then I'll tell them, uh, like coronavirus, they are all not always harmful. Do you know the amount of microorganism present in our body? Then I'll pause and then I'll say, they outnumber human cells by 10 to 1. And then I'll show them that 10 to 1 on my fingers. So we are 90% microorganism and 10% human. These microorganisms aid in digestion, helps in mental health, and plays many roles in keeping our good health. So people will li listen attentively. So this is my change in speech style, gesture, and pausing. Then I'll ask them, because I'm talking about the good side of the microorganisms, I'll ask them, you must have seen how milk is turned into curd. Then I'll ask that, I'll just ask one, one particular student that you must have seen how milk is turned into curd. So that student will tell me, yes, my mother adds a little curd to warm milk to set curd for next day. So that is change in interaction style. Now I'll directly talking to one pupil, teacher to pupil. Then yes, bacteria present in the curd multiplies in milk and promotes the formation of curd. And then I'll ask them, give me some more examples where microorganisms are used in your home. So then they'll tell me making of bread and pizza, idli, cheese, pickles, etc. So that's the end of my presentation. And uh, the components are movement, gesture, change in speech pattern, focusing, change in interaction style, audiovisual switching, pausing, physical involvement of pupil. That's all. Thank you. Mm -hmm.